nothing better than the smell of spoilers. What's up guys, I love here, and here we are to do a breakdown and a spoiler discussion for chapter 149 of Four Nights of the Apocalypse. And I notably have no idea what this chapter is called. I forgot to read like what it was called at the end of the last chapter. I haven't seen anything about this chapter. I don't know, the leaks came out like super duper late. Like, I, I don't have any idea about anything. So now I'm actually very, very excited. So let's not waste any more time. And let's hop right into it. Editing me. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go. What's up, guys? That guy with a pencil here. Fun fact, I do happen to have it on me. And keep it on me at all times. Another fun fact. This is going to be interesting. It's either Diane versus World Dane. The kids versus World Day, Diane and the kids versus World Day, or Diane King and the kids versus World Day. But, um, World Day seems quite cracked. <laughs> so I'm actually quite a bit worried for everybody. And the claw hands, I actually, this is a, this is a really cool contrast though. I like the clawed hands, like the top of the chain mail or, or the metal itself being clawed, but the floral pattern as well. That like, <laughs> that's a diabolical contrast right there. But let's see. What is transpiring? Oh, oops. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I forgot. Myrtle's still genuinely tweaking. <laughs> that's true. Because he's still... I, I keep forgetting that. Like, he's now just human-human. And since the Mullen Pills effects were negated and he doesn't have the Chaos buff anymore, now he's just a dude. Dudin. And Nauseans can't help him out, which is unfortunate. But King... The thing is, though, that's pretty impressive. Unless this ends up getting dispelled, like, in a second or two, because, you know, King's Magic Force got sealed away. The fact that the Spirit Spear is maintaining its form... Even in this, even in spite of the fact that King has lost a lot of his magic power, pretty impressive tech right there. I like. It. We'll see. What? Are, what are they talking about? The whole big sibling situation? Probably. Probably this is just a story to be like, I accept both of you as my big sibling, which is yeah. But I, I presume so. Like, like don't, still, don't get me wrong, though. I can completely understand Myrtle's fears, and I can completely understand Nasin's disgust with King. Both of those, in that scenario, considering how King had explained basically nothing. Like, like I get it, I get it. I 100% understand why Nasin wasn't feeling King, and why Myrtle wasn't feeling King, based on that. And why Myrtle was feared, or fearing the idea of him getting replaced. Especially since Nasin is just the biological kid. That fear would take over anybody. And it's unfortunate, it's unfortunate about the timing of that, dog. Like, if, think about it. Realistically, if Worldane and Kilbagon had shown up, like, a day later. Or heck, maybe even a day earlier. Like, legitimately, the whole... <laughs> it's crazy to think about, but a lot of, a lot of the conflict of this little arc has been based on revelations happening in the same day. <laughs> Which is wild. But let's see. What's happening? Oh, <laughs> King, what about the bubble? Wait, where, where is King? Oh, he's on the show. <laughs> Ride wife, life good. <laughs> That's adorable. That's adorable. Oh, dog of a man. Not, I, I, this, maybe, does he not have the fun? I, he's, but no, it's really sins. I, I know the anime itself ended up falling off a cliff. At least for the original anime. But Fortnite's ended up getting a solid enough studio. Like, Nakama, can you not... Can you not hire help, bro? Like, it's okay. It's okay to accept help, by G. I I get it. It's, it's probably more efficient. And, like, notably, the manga probably just gets completed exactly to Nakama's standard for the most part. Because he's doing everything. But, dog. Uh, like, it's blatant, too. Because there's the detail everywhere else on the panel. Down from their clothes to the hair. But then you can see Gideon's incomplete. And, like, I know you, Nakama. If you had the time, this would be this would be complete, my G. But let's see. This is still adorable. <laughs> Though they do they actually look kinda small. I feel like the head should be like at least she should take up a bit more of the page. But let's see. <laughs> Just zoom in. But King, undo the bubble. King. Your your adopted son is currently freaking and tweaking right now. King, if you don't undo it, come on now, my G. Let's see. Myrtle still feels guilty, but yeah, I can still, yo, I, I can't imagine that, like, I love my mama, like, like I'll, I'll be honest, my mama, my mama, and I love my, I love my dad, too, I love both my parents deeply, but like, if I were to have ever, under any circumstance, done something like Myrtle did, even if I was under the influence of something, 
yeah, that guilt, that guilt, it wouldn't go away ever. Like I'd be, I'd be looking at it funny the entire, like the entire rest of my days because I just feel that guilty. So I can understand why Myrtle's going through it. <laughs> Nazism? You giving your fist up? Are you mad that you aren't getting much of your own arc, buddy? Huh? Nazis, my boy. Nazis, or my my child. Nazis, did you just did you just pop a spirit spear? Ooh, you gotta get a papa. Say, mother of mercy, what, what, what? Chastity fool obeyed him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sweet mother of mercy, my boy Nasian's about to be cracked. <laughs> yes. Give him a bone pill, though. Myrtle needs it. Please, please. Help that boy out. We'll see. Uh oh. King, you got a headache? What's going on, my G? It's still. Uh, I don't. I, like, don't give me, I, I do like this king. Don't get me wrong. I still like it. And I get it, it's the most iconic king design. And notably, just by the size of the wings, it's different than any of the little wings kings we've seen before. But darn, man. Why did the two wild boy I know I know it's just gonna last like a couple chapters. I I really don't like unless World Dane truly gets out with the total of Droga de Yor and just straight up escapes escapes. I highly doubt that ultimately King's gonna be stuck like this for long. But come on, my G, I need all the full wings king I can get. You know how hard it is? He's so rare in the original series, too, please. Let's see. <laughs> I'm a world is just like okay okay I'm gonna tear out every single one of your vital organs like look at that smile bro <laughs> that is not the smile of someone with any positive attentions in life it is not it is true oh no what is she doing what is she doing with that helmet no <laughs> But, I, hey, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. One of my main things about Seven Blades that's a bit sad is that, like, who are the mages? Like, pure mages. Merlin? Vivian? And, like, I guess you could say Chandler, but Chandler's more a mixed attacker. I, it's crazy to say that. I know he's, like, a highly specialized mage, but, like, bro... Well, actually, no. Nah, I'd say until he transforms... Because no, notably, throughout his entire first run-in with the Seven Deadly Sins, he's mostly a mage. Like, almost down to the wire a mage from his first interaction with Merlin, to his interaction with Bod and everything. So, like, he was heavily mage-based with some physicals. But then, like, once he transformed, he turned basically just into another Meliodas. That had, like, some magical abilities. And he called True Knight. Like, I swear, I don't remember him doing much magically at all in the Escanor, Ludachel, Merlin, Zeldris, Kusak, Chandler fight. So, like... I'll take it, especially in a world that's so heavily based in magic. The fact that we don't have too many pure mages is kind of crazy, so I'll definitely take World Aid. I'm glad that one of the four evils is just a super-duper cracked mage. But why are you all attacking? If, the, if, if that thing took down your big brother, is this really the time to run smoke? Especially you, actually. Pow. Yeah, my G. Go run smoke. You alone. We need a sacrifice. Pow. It's for the greater good. I'd call you my friend, but then I'd be lying. Pal, do it for me. Do it for your mother, your father, your siblings. Don't worry, pal. You won't be missed. Okay, let me say... <laughs> Actually, no. We're not stopping. Pal, you're worthless. More worthless than Myrtle ever was. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, I'm not. But let's see. Who? What is this? Darn, oh, she deep fried it! That's why y'all need to run! It is not worth it! But what is that? We don't even see the helmet. Okay, so I'm assuming that's Belt. Gets deep fried. Gets blasted! <laughs> Jeez! World Dane. This is just the sw the exaggerated swagger of a Camelot ancient individual. One thing, I think this I think this is the mage. I think World Dane is just an, another immortal mage. Like, kind of like a Merlin scenario, because I think she was called the creator of the Lizard Folk. So, like... I'm, th I'm thinking that's her, but let's see. Darn! I th I, is that Exterminate Ray? Oh, look, and yeah, she's 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 got the bag. She's got the bag. We got Gawain's opponent right here, ladies and gentlemen. We got Gawain's opponent right here. All right. Let's see. Oh, it's Darn! She does not miss. 
straight. Actually, she kind of does. Like, I'm here. Isn't the heart here? Like, like in the dead center? So, she low-key did miss. Like, you went through the shoulder blade. I mean, still, it's going to hurt. But still. Darn, knocked her back. How? What are you actually going to do? What? Why? It's, it's the throw that you're supposed to be protecting. How y'all get solo by the hammer? No! Not the hammer, the helmet. How are y'all so trapped? Pow! I expect that from you. I really do. The fact that you were even able to sync remotely at all with your siblings is simultaneously impressive and an insult to their capabilities. But Zana, I expected be No, Zillion, I expected better from you, young lady. How could you fall for the okie doke like this? Gosh darn it. It's made of metal. Why don't you bend it? But let's see. <laughs> the swat not even moving and then catching the Doga de Yor. Okay. Well, they probably just willed it to themselves. And then the mask. Don't put the mask back on. Ooh. I ain't gonna lie. That's a hard panel. That's a hard panel. Yo. Catching the Doga de Yor. The helmet goes right back on. The right. Yo. Okay. I, I, gotta, I can't lie to you. That is pretty metal. That's why y'all should have just ran. Y'all should have not fallen for the okie doke and tried to throw hands with that thing. Come on out. Did y'all think y'all were six this? No, no, you were. Especially not you, pal. I'm sorry. I'm so biased. <laughs> Once again, I, I feel bad because that's one of the ones I just can't explain. I can't tell you why. I just don't like it. <laughs> I get ex whenever I dislike a character, I pride myself on being able to explain why I don't like them. Even if they're a popular character, I can typically explain whether it's the hipster in me, or something about their design, or something about their character writing. I can explain it. How? They're just an insult to my existence. I don't know what it is. Just every single time Nakama draws them, I feel a piece of me die. You know what I'm saying? And normally, they rarely get incomplete panels, so this is just an insult. Well, let's see. Tart. King Diane, come save your kids, G! Oh, and she's gone. And she's like, what are y'all really? <laughs> you know, I can't even knock the hustle, though. Rolda is like, did y'all really think y'all were built like that? For one of me? The four evils? After I low-dipped your big brother? <laughs> I'm on now. It's just straight. Yeah, I'd, I'd flex, too. I'd flex, too. No lie. It's kind of, it's kind of in the contract. You gotta. It's in the contract. You kind of got to do it. Have to do it to darn the whole royal family laid out. He's crazy. She really collected them all like Pokemon. She needs one more for a full team, G. She got the she got the fairy flying type. She got another fairy flying type. A ground type. Another ground type. And then a disappointment. But still, golly. But notably, she left them all alive. Which is kinder than I think. Like, especially for an Arthur subordinate. You really think she just... Like, it's the whole royal family. Like, might as well. I mean, I guess maybe it's just to make sure that King doesn't actively tweak it, but you sealed King's magic. And you're taking away the only thing that could unseal King's magic, presumably, considering how high-level a mage you are. Unless Merlin comes out of nowhere and just like, BT-dubs, absolute cancel, deuces. It, like, dips out. But that's interesting. Worldane seems to be... Unless unless they're about... Let me see, are they about to, like, vaporize them all? Oh, nope. No, at least, it doesn't seem like it. But Diane is booking it! Diane, leap! Leap, Diane, please! You gotta jump to the top. Save the babies! Save my son, Sixes. And my daughters, Zana and Zillion. And my other son, Belt. If you're wondering about Pow, you know exactly what I think should happen to Pow. Don't pretend that you don't. Once again, we gotta lose something in this arc. And if we're losing something... It might as well be Pow. Let's see. Diane? Oh! Uh, she <laughs> I respect it, though. I respect it. Why kick Loki? Look like he went Super Saiyan. But, okay, dark. But he's so... That's the thing, though. Do you really want to throw him at her? Because now he's weak. Like, notably... I Because they won't... They just don't know. That's the thing. They... The... People of the Assembly Sin side have so little information on the potency and ability of the knights. Like, we still don't know Ironside's full... Well, we probably do. We've, we've seen Ironside's full power, so Bond knows that. Presumably. Unless Ironside, for some reason, was holding back against Bond, which I highly doubt. But, they don't know Pelgard's full strength. They don't know Belt's leap still full strength. 
They just know he's strong. They don't know World Ain's full strength. So I would not throw my nerfed husband. But at the same time, Diane is battle damage. So maybe they're like, eh, you 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 fly for the most part. You're just battle damage. But what's King gonna pull out? Are we, oh, are we gonna see an earlier form of the Spirit Sphere? Let's see. Oh, straight whiffed. <laughs> more than just like me forever. Like I'm, I I'm still untouched. <laughs> I'm still her. But let's see. Up, oh, they're all like, Pops! <laughs> what you doing here, Pops? Wait, is he gonna use... He's gonna pull out Basquiat's? Please pull out Basquiat's. For the one time, for the two time. Oh. Oh, never mind. Oh, bro still has the full kit. Golly G. Willie. Okay. Talk that talk. I thought you were done, my G. That's the full size spirit spirit. What? King. My apologies, because I was not familiar with your game, my G. Golly. With sealed magic force and everything? Okay. Okay, King. I'll admit, I was sleeping. I thought we were going to see, like, maybe a middle stage between, like, the second variation of the True Spirit Spear and the final one. But nah, this is this is the full shebang bang. But what's World Day going to do? Full counter? <laughs> Clean with it. Clean with it. What was that? What is? What can they not do? <laughs> what? Like... In, like, the span of three chapters. Realistically, just the span of this whole arc, World Dane has already become an equal mage to Merlin, in my opinion. All they need is some more elemental spells. I'll give it that. They need some more elemental spells. But, like, the only thing they haven't shown is Chronostasis, which I think is, like, iffy on whether that's even battle applicable in the first place. But I've seen Spatial Manipulation, Perfect Cube. Actually, no, they performed, like, a four-element spell when they locked... Sixes in the perfect cube. Cloning. Manipulations of clones. Creating an entire species. D time manipulation to a degree. Memory manipulation. Like, they're kind of cracked. What is this? Let's see. What's it going to hit? What's it going to hit? Oh, another incomplete panel. I'm not going to take some rest, bro. Oh, no. Wait. Wait. Wait a minute. Hold up. Wait a minute. Sixes. Sixes. Chill out, bro. Chill out, bro. I saw Nazis that control the Spear Spear earlier. Sixes, please. Sixes, please. Nazis put the hand out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's my boy. That's my child. Oh. Oh, we, we're cooking with gas now, ladies and gentlemen. I've been waiting so long. They're finally letting my boy cook. I feel so happy now. I'm so not from them letting him God, yes! That's what I'm talking about. Darn, but he's straight trans. He's actually going Super Saiyan. Bro's turning into King. And he's wielding the full spirit. Spirit has like, oh, yes! Okay. W, where are you? W chapter. Undeniably, yeah, baby. So the next King of the Fairy. That's my child. <laughs> If you have made it all the way to the end of this video, please leave new king. Leave new king in the comment section down below. I'd like to thank you so much for watching. Please remember to leave a like, share, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you hit that little notification bell so you not miss out on any videos that come to the channel. Also, also, I do happen to have a Patreon below where you can support me for as little as one, get one, double, you can take exclusive videos, early content, and more. You also now become a member of the channel for as little as three dollars a month to get the same perks and more. So those perks include the live reaction to this very chapter, add free variations of all my videos, and if you become a twenty-five dollar patron or a twenty-five dollar member, you can order whatever video you want. Also, also, also. I do have the link to my Ko-Fi in the description down below if you want to make a one-time donation for your boy, a one-time short video request for five beans, or a regular video request for 25 beans. All that is in the description down below. But now, I'd like to thank you so much for watching once again, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. This is Dagger the Pencil, writing off. I'd like to give a thank you to our three dollar members: O'Connor Plays, Greyhound, Akids Void, Astro, Eternal Flame, Red Wolf, Four Seven Six Five, King Sukuna, NMA, Real Rare, Paris Arnold, and G Prosper. And I'd like to give a thank you to our five dollar members: Super Gamer Q, Steron, Sean, Sammy, Oexian, Midnight Lord Twenty One, Kevin, Encarnacion, Josh Brown, and A Plus A.
And that lady with a thank you to our $7 member, Autumn Mornings Lazo. And I'd like to give a thank you to our $10 members, Robbie Uchia and Jay Warrior. And I'd like to give a thank you to our $10 patrons, Joaquin Munoz, Joaquin Munoz, and Ida Mokami. And I'd like to give a final gargantuan thank you to our $25 patron, Calvin Alder.